renovations at the Capital Area District Library, the downtown Lansing branch has been closed since New Year's Eve, but it's about to reopen. Fox 47's Elizabeth Crenshaw gives us a sneak peek inside. The ringing won't stop at the Capital Area District Library as it gets ready to reopen. Really, the whole thing is terribly exciting uh, to all of us. With a new improved look, the library has a new feel for 2017. As soon as patrons walk through the door, they will find a larger lobby. On the first floor, the fiction and nonfiction book sections have expanded and the children have their own half with their own games, books and tables. Just make things a little more easily to, easy to get to. We had this big X where the collection was, so we opened it up. We wanted to have bright colors and we did new carpeting. Kathy Johnson, head librarian for the Downtown Lansing Library, says one of the newest upgrades includes study rooms located on the second floor. The rooms are wired uh, with not really nice tables, comfortable chairs, uh, whiteboards. Uh, and they're, they're geared for quiet study, uh, which a lot of patrons had asked us for, so they can have just a little bit more privacy. Patrons will also see new furniture, more computers with outlets to run oh, devices, yeah. larger handicap accessible bathrooms, and a special room for microfilm. But despite all the new upgrades, the library staff just wants people to feel at home. I hope people come and see the differences. People who haven't been in the library in a long time, just come down and see what it's like. I think they're really going to be surprised and you'll be introduced to all of the services that we have, which a lot of people don't know about. In Lansing, Elizabeth Crenshaw, Fox 47 News. The library will have a ribbon cutting ceremony Monday. There will be a family celebration on April 1st to show off the new space.